Hello class, today we're going to continue to look at our outing algorithm. Today, instead of using pennies and dimes, we are going to be using a grid. Our first question says 12 cents plus 29 cents. And we are going to write that on our little graph. We have 12 cents plus 29 cents. We're going to start here in our ones place. 9 plus 2 is 11. But I cannot put 11 in one column. I'm going to put a group of 10 over here and the 1 from the 11 over here. I have 1 plus 2, which is 3, plus 1 more, which is 4. My answer now is 41. I'm going to move over here and put 55 plus 26. 5 plus 6 is 11, but I can't put 11 in one column or in one place. So I'm going to take a group of 10 and I'm going to put it over here. It's kind of hard to see. 5 plus 2 is 7, plus 1 more is 8. I would like for you to complete the rest of this row. What if we don't have a grid form? Hmm. We can still write our questions vertically instead of horizontally. I'm going to write 49 and then 24 underneath of it, making sure that my ones place and my tens place are lined up. 9 plus 4 is 13. I'm going to put a little 1 in the tens column, and I have 4 plus 2 is 6, plus 1 more is 7. The answer here is 73 cents. Here I'm going to write 52 plus 24, but I'm going to write them vertically instead of horizontally. 4 plus 2 is 6, and 5 plus 2 is 7. My answer is 76 cents. Today, I would like for you to take questions that are written horizontally and write them vertically. I know you're gonna do a great job. Have a great day, class. Bye-bye.